Hello traders. So if you're looking to start a Telegram signal channel where you could send out signals from Telegram directly to your client's MT4 account, ensuring those trades are placed at the exact same time and managing those trades directly from Telegram. In this video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how to do that. First, head over to tradingkennel.com and search for the Red Fox Copier. I'm also going to be adding this link here in the description below for you guys. Now, this expert advisor is available for just $50 only and it's for lifetime. You also get access to future versions of this expert advisor for free. You can add this to your cart and purchase it directly or if you're subscribed to either our silver or gold membership, you can download this product and all of the software available on our platform for free. Now, once you download this and extract this, you're going to get this file here. As you can see, this is just a single expert file and it contains the Red Fox Copier Pro version 1.9. So all you just need to do is to right click here and copy this file here, then head over to your MT4, click on file, click on open data folder, click on MQL4, click on experts and paste this here. Click on replace. All right. The next thing you need to do is to head over back to the website, scroll down a little bit to the product description here. And you're going to see something called installation information. So copy the URL here. Then head over back to your MT4. Click on tools, click on options. And then add this URL here. So I'm not going to be adding this because I already have this URL here. So once you've added the URL here, just click on enter to add it here and then click on OK. So once you're done with that, head over to telegram.com and search for the bot father. Once you do that, you're going to gain access to this page. Click on menu and then click on new bot. I'm going to be going with Red Fox Tony Copier. Click on enter and then it says we're going to be choosing a username for the bot and it must end in bot. I'm going to be using Red Fox Tony Copier bot. Just going to click on enter. You can see we've now created a new bot. Just going to click on here to access the bot here. And here you can see the username of the bot. So I'm going to copy the username here and I'm going to head over to my signal channel here. Now, this is my signal channel. If you haven't created a signal channel, you can proceed to do so. So I'm just going to click on the signal channel. I'm going to click on add to add a new member and I'm going to add the username here. Now you can see the bot here. So I'm going to click on it and click on add and I'm going to add it as an admin. And I'm going to give you access to everything except adding new admins. So I'm going to click on save. And I'm going to click on cancel. All right. So you see now I now have 15 subscribers and I also have it added as an admin now. You can see that. So next I'm going to head over back to bot father and I'm going to copy the token here of the bot I just created. Now remember for every new client that you have, you have to create a new bot. You can have them do this or you can do it for them. All right. So I'm going to go back to my MT4 here. And I'm going to head over to tools, click on options. Make sure you have allow automated trading checked. Make sure you also have this checked and this checked as well. So once you're done with that, you can click on OK, click on view, click on market watch to bring out a symbol on your chart. Now, it doesn't matter which symbol you bring out as this expert advisor will place trade on whichever symbol the signal was given on. Now, next, we need to open our navigator here and right click on the expert advisors here and click on refresh. Then you can expand it if it's not expanded here. Then click on the Red Fox Copier Pro here. Now we can see we now have this up. The next thing we need to do is to add the token which we copied from Telegram. So I'm just going to add the token here. I'm going to click on Enter. And now we've added the token here. Now let's look at the other settings that we have here as well. And the first thing you can see here is Auto Lots. Now you can either choose to have a fixed lot size or you can have an automated lot size. An automated lot size would vary depending on your risk. So what are you risking on your account? In this case, you could risk 0.5%. All right, so we're going to be having a fixed lot size. You're going to add that here as well, all right? And you can also add multiple orders as well. Now you can also go through the rest of the settings, but there is one that actually stands out here, which is the start hour and the end hour. You could set that to zero for start hour and set that to 23 for end hour. You can also set um, slippage conditions and spread conditions as well. So I'm just going to click on OK. And automatically, you can see that we now have the bot activated here. Now it says successfully connected to Telegram here. So the next thing we are going to do now is to head over to Telegram 
and head over to our signal channel and I'm just going to type RFC status and you can see we now have the Red Fox Copier Pro initializing. Now I'm going to head over to trinkenal.com and you can see the rest of the signals that we have, the signal format that we have. So we have sell, we have sell, you have limit orders, you have stop orders as well. So I'm just going to use um, this for an example here. I'm going to copy this here. I'm going to minimize here and I'm going to do an RFC status again to ensure that the bot has been initialized. All right, so you can now see it says bot is running here. So next, I'm going to place a trade. I'm going to place that trade on gold. Just going to place a trade here. Click on enter. And you can see it says all that success here. So if you head over back to your MT4, you can see we now have a trade placed for XAUSD. Now remember, we don't have the expert advisor here. We have the expert advisor only on GBPUSD, but it's able to place a trade on all pairs. Now to close this order, I'm just going to right click and reply to the message I sent, the order I sent here, and I'm going to click on RFC, type RFC close. And automatically, the order has been closed. So I hope this video was helpful to you, and if it was, please like, comment, and share. And if the video wasn't helpful enough for you, and you run into some issues or some errors, please reach out to us, and we are going to help you set it up.